Simply learn. Your pace, your place. Minitab Statistical Capabilities Part 2 Hello and welcome to Simply Learn's e-learning course on Minitab. This is Part 2 of the fifth session and the last session in this course. There are quizzes at the end of every session and you are strongly advised to answer them before you move on to the next session. This session takes you through the Part 2 of the statistical capabilities of Minitab and how you can analyze your data statistically. Agenda Let us now look at the agenda of this session. In this session, we learn the scenarios where these tools are used and how to analyze and interpret our data in Minitab using the following tests. Design of experiments Control charts Let us now look at each of these in detail. Business scenarios The tools like design of experiments and control charts are most commonly used in the following business scenarios. Design of experiments is used to understand the impact of various factors to a process and also to understand the interaction within various factors. This helps to take important decisions on which factor to change to have the desired changes to the process. Control charts are used to track process statistics over time and to detect the presence of special causes in the process. Special causes result in variation that can be detected and controlled. Statistical Tools Design of Experiments DOE. Let us start by looking at how to use Design of Experiments in Minitab. Design of Experiments In this topic we will cover Understanding of Design of Experiments or DOE How to set up a factorial design How to analyze the factorial design How to use factorial plots for main effects and How to use factorial plots for interactions Design of Experiments DOE helps you to Screen the factors to determine which are important for explaining a certain process variation. Understand how factors interact and drive your process. Find the factor settings that produce optimal process performance. 